In this video, we will show you how to make a grow bag to produce green vegetables. We have a large growing bag here with holes for 100 plants. There is a medium sized bag with holes for 80 plants and a small bag that grows 50 plants. A pile of good quality compost is ready for the growing bag. The next pile is an equal size pile of good quality soil. Each pile is four wheelbarrow loads of material. Next we have a pile of dry material, in this case grevillea leaves, that will let the water move through the soil in the bag. A bag of ballast or small stones will go in the center of the bag to keep it upright and allow the water to flow to the bottom of the bag. Some DAP fertilizer will boost growth. And finally a pipe to place in the center of the bag while it is being filled to hold the ballast in place. The next step is to uniformly mix the soil and compost. This organic material is important for the success of your grow bag crop. Well decomposed manure is suitable, but good compost like we are using here is the best. Roll the bag down and place the pipe in the center. Then start to fill the grow bag with the soil compost mix. Fill the pipe with ballast. A layer of dry leaves has been added to the bag, more soil is added, and then a layer of dry leaves. The soil compost mix is carefully packed to the outside of the bag. Careful packing will make the bag a uniform shape and keep it from falling over. After another layer of dry leaves, continue to add soil compost mix, carefully packing the bag to maintain the shape. As the bag is fill filled, pull up the pipe, leaving the ballast or rocks in the center of the bag. Add ballast to bring the rock water channel to the top of the bag.
cover the top of the bag with dry leaves and then start to water the completed bag. It will take about four buckets of water to soak the bag. The bag is now ready for plants. We have kale for one side, spinach for the other side with peppers for the top. Carefully select the kind of plants for the sides and different plants for the top. The sides are limited to plants like kale and spinach which can curl up and grow. The top can take a wider variety of plants such as cabbage and capiscums. Poke holes in the poke holes in the soil at the openings which will make it easier to put the plants in the bag. The finished bag will have 100 plants or the equivalent of a 150 foot row in the garden. The top is finished with cabbage and capiscum plants. The bag should be protected from birds and chickens or other animals in your area. A fence about two meters square could be placed around the bag. A grow bag can be replanted for up to two years. Depending on growing conditions, the first vegetable should be ready in about three weeks. Two bags per family should produce enough greens for a family year-round. Here we see the bag after the first harvest. For maintenance, hand weed the bag, watch and spray for pests and use foliar fertilizer. For maintenance the bag will need about a bucket of water a week. When the bag is growing carefully water so that the water is distributed evenly all over the bag. We hope this video has been helpful and that you and your family enjoy the greens from your grow bag.